No point trying to escape. Clear list. To interrupt our program for a special announcement from the planning bunker of the National Council. Dear fellow citizens, the military staff of the Julian Federation has just learned of a new atrocity. The peasant units led by the heretics have captured one of, uh, of the most dangerous weapons. The Julian people will now make even greater effort and will join together to defy the enemy. Our battle for justice and prosperity will enter the glorious annals of Julian history. Right. A little bit of propaganda for us. Demon must die. Uh, we can't go through that without a road, so we'll have to go. It's a constructor. There's the artillery piece here. The extra energy is significant enough that I'm willing to risk a little bit to getting it. Mm, need ammunition. You can still function the anti air road, but it's, uh, I think the baiters are much better at that anyway. Go back, go back. We can, yeah, we can go to our headquarters too. I guess the headquarters can uh, house any top unit. Uh, I don't want to take the helicopter out of here. Uh, there's a good chance we could use it when we need to go here or here, so I'll, I'll want to have this entire place under our control before I risk uh, getting like that. Easily shut it down already. Fuck. But now it's within striking distance of vital targets.
No, you go there. want to risk this side, not even that. Not for any reason. It, it probably produces, uh, well, it produces a good chunk of our overall energy supply. Resupply about 40 to 50 times these missiles. Anything we need to deal with right now? I think so. Right. Everything looks good. We might lose the ranger, I suppose, but that happens. Looks like they have more support units than anything else. I'm okay with that. So we are going to need spotting power. Clouds, light showers. We need to basically try to connect this road to that. that. That's the minimum we need to be able to do. This artillery piece. You can probably see us. The range is five, I think. One, two, three, four. This is sort of like getting to decide every turn which two enemy units you want to remove. 
We better enjoy this, we're not gonna be able to do this all that often. I'll keep our aircraft sort of uh, in the background. We just have to be able to react to enemy activity. I want to go left forward. I have to keep in mind that he he will have these same missiles as we do. And it's just a matter of time before he starts raining them on top of us. not an if or anything, it's going to happen. We're very, very, very well aware that it's going to happen. And that's why I'm sort of holding these ghosts in the background, even though we would have easy targets to attack. They're, they're not for that purpose. I want to repair the ranger, I, I really should. They're very valuable and we don't really have a way to replenish our ranger supplies. About steam. Can't really attack anything interesting and every time we go and push things forward, we're Left open their uh, missile attacks. Again, from the same place. I'm not taking the recon satellite anywhere near here. Seems like this is more or less their range. And their attack range is two. So, yeah. If I take the satellite here, the satellite I can decrease. It's just gonna be swat. They're just gonna swat it down. 
and then uh, we're in fairly a large amount of trouble, in fact. Now, what to do? No more samurai for you. Three showers. This is gonna be awful. I sort of want to get rid of their air defense. I suppose we should secure the immediate area first. Nash Horn sitting in a fortified location and doesn't make a difference, just disappears, melts away. Barely move now. We're gonna need a refuel craft some sword. Alternatively we could not move you. Stay put as much as possible. It would just be a great unit to take down this. At the same time we could use experience for the others. Lovely names. Yeah, we could also destroy the bridges, I suppose, if we wanted to. But I don't see how that benefits me. Definitely nearing areas where it's reasonable to believe that they have some kind of a radar capability. So we have to be at least somewhat cautious. We could also put a few troops in a bader and just drive there. But it's uh, it is incredibly reckless. Yeah, it can work out wonderfully for you, but it can basically kill you too. Last chance for a while. We're gonna get stuck in the mud. No two ways about that. Okay, 
Okay, do we want to attack with the ghosts or not? I sort of think we should. other here. No, don't move, don't move anywhere. Conserve fuel. I need to conserve energy, see if I can get out some kind of plane to fuel it. what it is. Fuck. So it's not shooting us with missiles? So we'll have a full experience there on our, on our hands. That's something. Hmm. No more sting for you. so good to have these. For once, we are the ones with the ridiculously overpowered units here. Now. Yeah, we're not gonna move here anytime soon, so... Can we build more roads? I don't think so. turn. We do have to move to get rid of these. Yeah, they're harmless in a way, but they're also blocking the way, acting as spotter and things like that. I can't just ignore them either. Mm, we really could use the tanker plane. Um, even the stealth fighters will have a tough time moving about. Mm, too little energy to do anything. Hmm. 
Okay, it's pretty clear we aren't moving anywhere for a while. Both at the same time, they are not gonna mount any kind of a major offensive either. So we're just gonna sit here and stare at each other. Feels like more time has passed than it really has. So I'm all taking the turn, turn limit constantly. We really have nothing to worry about in that front. No more rocket time for you. Also run out of turns before before we run out of a refill, so we don't have to replace the ammunition trucks with him, which is also nice. How much energy do we have? Nineteen. It's not going to be good enough for anything. Plus two energy. Very point, very little point doing anything here. We're not gonna try to take this until we're very secure of this general area. Without a doubt, facilities from here and here can provide some kind of a cover fire for that. I don't want the vision to really move anywhere anyway. It doesn't have that much fuel, and each turn will use up a little bit of fuel. So, with the extra energy, I think we're gonna go for a refueling plane. UX2. Now they start to bombard us. It's gonna be pretty much the same thing around here. Every turn someone's going to die. We are gonna need to refuel the plane though. We cannot make refueling planes. Could make a long range exterminator. Hunter drones are not bad, but they don't have the range. Well, their fuel capacity is just pretty full. The fighter bombers aren't exactly that much better. I don't think we can attack with the planes. It's a one way trip if we want to take something. Still. 
shift in the battle, missiles starting to rain, rain on us. But that doesn't mean it change all that much. We, we just don't have the capability of moving around. Suppose we could move the vision forward, but it's already starting to slow down and we don't have that many turns left. So, new targets available. Pine Star gone. Ooh, and there's a ranger menace we'll have to deal with. Still, revealing the new target is pretty good. We, we needed to know this. It's, it's a lot of artillery that they can't use against us. I'd like to say this goes in case we basically... It has a single shot against ground targets, so in case we locate the medium-range missile they have. There's also jamming something here. So, obviously. Use a little bit of fuel. do with the points. We can't do the... The healing plan, we got to do something else. We're not going to get any extra factories here. They have them, but by the time we get them, it's, uh, they're not going to contribute to what we're doing. Which means we need to produce units now. I think we might make exterminators. The purpose would be a suicide unit to just attack their... Uh, medium range missile. They will reveal 
other weaknesses or strengths of their defenses too. So Let's see how it works. I really need the weather change though. Otherwise we're just stuck here and we're gonna get bombarded every turn. Right, yes. Don't shoot the missiles now. Just... I need to see. I really need to see. Okay. Right. What do they have on the others? Factories are here. Airfield, Spectrum, Exterminator, Iron Star, Invader. So, they probably have their medium range missiles there. Okay. Just need to be able to make sure that the next time the weather gets bad, we have the ability to move around our forces. Um, doesn't look like we're gonna get any more scouting done. Okay. We don't want the iron star there. What else don't we want here? Um, probably any long range artillery type. Although the goddamn sun. Ranger has to die. It sees too much. Demon has to die. But who kills it? We do want to start pushing forward. The fact that we are gonna get bombarded by the missiles isn't gonna change that. We just have to go in there and take the shots. get past the virus, but they can, uh, I suppose we can dump a missile on it.
I'd like to move a little bit closer. Right. No need to rush things. Suicide plane. Does no one need repairs? Anything? Sort of do. We're opening more targets. Soon. soon it's not going to matter. When I get to the point where instant kills are a thing. Still the house. What to do with the samurai? Suppose we're gonna force the issue. Whatever you think you can to stop us. want to move the recon on our satellite now. I want to move it when we have the two missiles ready to launch. Find something interesting, then to be able to react immediately. Anyone need... Anyone need fuel desperate. Back to the front line, we need everyone here now. Someone's going to bite the bullet, but I'm hoping it won't be anything, anyone too critical. Which means you could start moving toward the front lines, please. Uh, do I need to move closer? I'd like to be within strike distance of any targets there. Now we see what they have. UX2 I'm a star on their center. Worthless exterminator. It's spotter. It looks like they might have a single UX2 rocket. A missile.
There it is. Let's do. How easy, easy it is. Uh, we need to decide what needs to go right now. Uh, I want to capture this one and this one. And I want to, well, at least this one. I should do it. Get rid of the mine. Ah, just fucking. Ooh, shit. Well, that sort of works. Do they have any additional missiles? They might have. Find out. Really have there's no hurry. You don't absolutely have to get anything. Just build the goddamn road. This is the one we can attack without relying on the missile. Missile of hovercraft. Right. This is new possibilities. Suppose we should just remove their troublesome units. We can re start removing the mines some other time. I think it's too important what we do, as long as we keep challenging their forces constantly. But they don't have um, any kind of a resting period anymore. Get 
the mine we can easily get rid of two ways. Either we'll drive a hovercraft there, or we're just gonna missile it away. Alternatively, it only has one shot, so just suck it up. Produce more aircraft or something. Don't know. There's no point in you staying here anymore. Still attack one target, and I'm. Yep. We're not gonna remove move the recon satellite anymore. I'll have to be careful. Seeing. If they have any more of those uh, missile launchers, I don't think they matter at this point. Yeah. We should be able to wrap things up very quickly. We need both the... We needed to destroy the missile launcher and now we need the two factories. And that's the end of it. So we should be able to wrap up very quickly. Ooh, another iron star. It's on their right side. Yeah, they've got them. They can produce crap, I'll give them that, but it's not enough. Still, I produce crap. They should not be able to attack us on the water. need to kill them, I just need to drive them away. Doesn't mean I can't kill them. Keep the pressure on, drive them away, push them back. Here, I'm a bit surprised. Where the hell is the Iron Star supposed to be? Then? I'm not gonna fire now. I need to be able to take down the demon and capture this. I 
Okay, shoot at something. Thing here. So, at least we did some mind clearing thanks to that. Now... That's half dead, that's half dead. at our options. We take the factory. Yes. Time we really want to. Do they have anything in the factory? Uh the enemies here. That hardly matters, but they might bring the samurai tank there, maybe even uh, something else. They have only one infantry unit here, have they? I want to get rid of their uh, troll too if I can. Uh, yeah, I don't have the range. I think I have to think about this too much anymore. It, it seems like our options are fairly narrow. So, the only even half mystery still left is the iron star they have. I, I don't care about it enough anymore. It doesn't matter, they can't protect their factories anymore. Has to be here. Probably there, in fact. Okay. Next turn, he's gonna lose one of the factories. The turn after that, he's gonna lose the other. We'll get a tank. See producing units? Not really. Yep. Should be fairly straightforward. We need to kill the elixir and that's pretty much it. The iron star is there. It takes about six 
Shot it with this. Or whatever. It doesn't really matter at this point. The demon has to die. If the demon dies, they have nothing to use to retake. I can't shoot right next to myself, but I don't have the range to shoot it. Almost, but not quite. So what do I want to shoot? Those tiles must continue removing the combat units. I have no capture units anymore. Whatever you do, you need to kill that snow bitch. Someone else kill it. Okay, this could be the. No, no, the next turn is the last turn. about it. So what do you got? You can kill something with the Iron Star, but you didn't. And that's it. Or rather, you couldn't. Might as well get all the experience we can out of this.
Totally pointless way to time movie. Still, I'm going to do it. New attack. You can. Well, it's pretty experienced. Mission complete. The Air Force is looking just fine now. And to rocks. An army would not always suspend all of it. There's not a good eno enough opportunities to spend that experience point in the Ah, shit, what is this time? Troops of the corrupt government have begun a huge counter-attack. Arga Kral may already be planning the decisive battle, for which we are not yet prepared. Although you have only a weak army, you must withstand the enemy's onslaught. Well, fuck. As soon as possible, we will send you UX2 missiles from our research center as reinforcements. Okay, so hold out until we can get this out apart. They should be able you to destroy the enemy units for good. Basic layout for the entire mission. Destroy all enemy units. So it's probably... Ooh, this is a small map. Very small. Like... One screen wide, two high. Barely two. Eh, pretty much exactly two. This is the research center. So nothing's gonna happen until suddenly there's gonna be a uh, missile launcher just popping up here. We're just going to have to hold out on the left. We have a couple of bottlenecks and a huge amount of infantry basically. Anything hidden in the structures? Well, how much time do we have? 60 turns doesn't matter. We get 6 energy each turn. It's not a lot. We have a couple of uh, radar parking vehicles. We have to we have to think quite hard where to place them. We have to protect our artillery and uh, basically prevent them from getting the HQ, I guess. We produce anything worthwhile. Artillery um, anti-radar vehicle elixir two. Cause 5 energy to uh, for material. Uh, we have radar vehicles, light artillery, and heavy tanks, infantry, support units. Uh, we could use more anti radar vehicles. Uh, protect our artillery and uh, gun placement, same here. Light artillery units wouldn't hurt either. We have ammunition replenishment on this side only. Fuel on the other side. So, first things first, we need more ammunition. We need a power core, no matter what. And then either elixirs or artillery, depending on what's going to happen.